so one of the things i like to just protest is the high you know price of um fuel which has affected a whole lot of um sectors in the economy and one of the reasons that they gave for taking our subsidies is the fact that there's so much corruption in the first subsidy process in their words so much corruption in the first subsidy process so now here's the thing if there's so much corruption why did the government not remove the corruption in this first subsidy you know um process first why did the government not take away the corruption in that in that segment first i trying to tell me that the corrupt people are now more powerful than the Nigerian government no it is because they cannot do that because it is them it is them them their friends their colleagues their people them them they are the ones that are all involved in the first subsidy, first subsidy scam because I've, I've not seen when you have a baby you finish batting the baby you now throw the baby away with the water no you hold the baby and throw the bath water away that's how it is so the so normal i'm not even a, i'm not a, an economist i'm not even in government but common sense is the people that are stealing from first subsidy you catch them and bring them to book first save some money then maybe you can start moving the subsidy small small depending on how you want to do it but no you just to create subsidy like that secondly um the the idea was that they would save funds from first subsidy for critical infrastructure put it in blah 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 so for the last one year that we've been saving money from first subsidy what have we done with it what have we done with it concrete evidence see the, the apc government can bring propaganda and say stuff but whatever you are saying if it doesn't translate what people can actually see and feel on the in, on the streets of nigeria it will remain propaganda and you can only lie for so long that is the reason for this one of the reasons for this process and the process is going to go on because in truth no matter how much english you speak people are hungry people are hungry i'm sure you are seeing people now that collected money for counter protest five thousand and now come back and say that they give them money for that Nigerians are getting wiser small small because why you can there is only so much you can do when it comes to hunger there's only so much you can do when it comes to hunger so i have to say we keep on end bad government in nigeria